Hello students, welcome back. Rubisco, the most abundant protein or enzyme present on our earth. Rubisco has carboxylase activity. In this part, we learn about its oxygenase activity. So let's start. Now we'll start with C2 cycle or glycolate pathway. This glycolate pathway is also known as photorespiration. First of all, Kotko indicated that more carbon dioxide evolves during the daytime in the C3 plants. The light dependent uptake of oxygen and release of carbon dioxide in the C3 photosynthetic cell is called photorespiration. So the photorespiration occurs in high concentration of oxygen. The photorespiration is not linked with ATP generation as ordinary dark respiration. Thus, it is harmful or a wasteful, uh, wasteful process that is linked with the C3 cycle or the Calvin cycle. The photorespiration is enhanced by bright light, high temperature, high oxygen and low carbon dioxide concentration. The, there is one enzyme, the Rubisco. So this Rubisco enzyme does not only shows carboxylase activity but it also shows oxygenase activity. It means that it cannot only react with carbon dioxide, it also reacts with oxygen uh, when there is high concentration of oxygen in the cells. So this Rubisco in high concentration of oxygen, when there is high concentration of oxygen, it converts RUBP that is ribulose 1,5 bisphosphate into one molecule of phosphoglyceric acid and one molecule of phosphoglycolic acid. So this is done in the presence of high concentration of oxygen. So we can say that oxygen is a competitive inhibitor for carbon dioxide on the active sites of the enzyme Rubisco. So this shows the inhibitory effect of oxygen in uh, photosynthesis and this inhibitory effect of photosynthesis was first observed. Uh, this inhibitory effect of oxygen on photosynthesis was first observed by Warburg. So this uh, photorespiration is also known as uh, Warburg effect. Now the reactions that takes place in the glycolate pathway or photosynthesis, they takes place in three organelles. The first organelle is the chloroplast, then peroxisome, and then the mitochondria. So the first reaction is the one in which the RUBP in the presence of high concentration of oxygen by the action of the enzyme Rubisco is converted into phosphoglyceric acid and phosphoglycolic acid. So this is done in the chloroplast.